northern Italy, 1933. With the threat of war casting an ominous shadow across Europe, an incredible series of events unfolds, all under the supervision of one of history's most powerful and feared leaders, Benito Mussolini. In 1933, it's claimed that a UFO crashed in the Lombardy region of Italy. This was apparently an object around 50 feet in diameter, like two saucers joined together. It was described as being grayish in color and metallic. And apparently it was then taken by the military and studied on the personal orders of the then dictator Benito Mussolini. According to some accounts, the UFO crashed near the city of Magenta, just 80 miles northeast of Mount Mucinay. The craft was found to be unoccupied, and unlocking its secrets became a top priority. This flying saucer was something that uh, the Mussolini government took a lot of interest in. And so there was an establishment of a group of experts to study this phenomenon, to study exactly what it involved, who made it. And this committee was called RS-33. To lead the committee, it is said that Mussolini enlisted the noted engineer and famed inventor of the radio, Guglielmo Marconi. Mussolini said, find out what it is, and because it seems to be so advanced, build one. And Marconi apparently said, well, we can't. It, we can't figure it out. There is a technology here over and above anything we possess. And that only left the conclusion that this, for want of a better term, was an extraterrestrial spacecraft. Was a crashed extraterrestrial craft really recovered by the Italian government in 1933?